forward for a brief children's message. Good morning. Oh, we do have one beautiful young lady among us. Well, two. I, I, I wasn't counting the adult ladies, but... <clears throat> come on up, come on up. All right, it's good to see all of you here. So let me ask you, when, when somebody does this, what does that mean? What, what's that? It might be too loud, or they're annoyed. They don't want to hear what you have to say, right? If you do this when somebody's talking to you, you're just like, ah, I can't hear you, right? You don't want to hear what they have to say. Sometimes that happens in life. We don't want to hear what somebody's got to say because it might not be fun for us. It might be sad for us. But you know what? Sometimes we do that to God, too. Sometimes we close our ears and we say, God, I don't want to listen. But God wants you to hear what he has to say because he's got some very important things for you to know. And he's, there's two special ones that I want you to know today, above all else that God might tell you, two things that I always want you to remember. Number one, God always wants you to hear that he loves you very much. He loves you so much he sent Jesus to die on a cross for you. That's the first and most important thing that we need to hear from God. And the second thing we would need to hear from God is that he wants us to tell other people about that because other people need to hear that message and they need to hear it from you. So two important things. God loves you and God wants to have you share that love with others. Okay? Will you pray with me for just a moment? And uh, some of you that have been here a long time, uh, you know uh, Troy and Jacob, and, and is it Isaac? Uh, Max, Max, I'm sorry, but um, they was, kind of showed up here a number of months ago, and, uh, and actually I want you guys to know that a number of people have been missing and said, where are those kids that have been sitting up front? Um, and they're moving, and today's their last day. So I'm going to say a little prayer for you and for your family as well here, okay? So let's pray uh, for right now. Heavenly Father, we, uh, we thank you for uh, talking to us, and we're sorry that we don't always want to listen to what you have to say. But we are so glad that the most important things that you have for us to, to hear are that you love us and that you want us to share that love with others. Father, we ask that you would be with Troy and Jacob and Max's family and, and be with them as they're moving and help them to find a new church down in Mount Pleasant. And Lord, we ask that you would just continue to bless them and their family in amazing ways. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. All right, guys and gals, you may return to your seat. And we will continue with Not Unto Us. <laughs> 